Hey, this is Rockin' Robin, and today I'm going to show you the things we bought at Disney when we went this time. Now, first I want to tell you, I brought home the magical Disney flu. So if I sound a little not myself, that's why. But I'll get over it. It's worth it with all this Disney stuff. Well, the first thing I want to show you are my pins. Uh, I've been collecting pins for many years, and I have a book of maybe a thousand of them. But uh, I bring every time a lanyard and I trade for pins. So I'm going to show you my traders first. Later we're going to open up a box, see what we got, and I'll show you some of the brand new ones I bought along, along with some uh, pressed pennies and, and a couple other goodies. Okay, so first I want to show you, I got this one. This one is from It's a Small World. I thought it was adorable. I hadn't ever seen it before. I hadn't, this is the only one I saw the whole trip, and I thought it was pretty cool. This one I got, it's Mr. Mouse, and supposedly I have to get the other one because there's a, a Mrs. as well. Another thing I got, I thought I had the whole thing, but I guess there's five of these. They're foot, little feet. That one's Donald Duck. This one is Goofy. This one is Mickey. And this one is Minnie. Now, if there's one that I missed, then you happen to have it. Let me know. I'd like to at least see it. Okay, so I when I first started, I usually always used to buy Mickey's. And then I switched, and now I'm into Halloween and Star Wars pins. But I still fall for Mickey's. You're not going to find a lot of expensive ones when you go trading. Uh, most of the time, pin traders will go to cast members, uh, someone in the stores. Sometimes they'll have little books, little pin uh, boards for you to look at. And you'll find some interesting pins there. Get the ones you like because valuable ones are going to be hard to get. I got a lot of Mickeys I want to show you. This is, he almost looks like a chubby Mickey. How cute he is. Uh, this Mickey looks like he's got an earphones to me. It's a red, red Mickey. Um, and there's some couple of cute little Mickeys here. This one as it turns around. I've got one with glasses. I love him. He is just the cutest thing. And then I always get some cute Mickey ears. I love the Mickey ears. I've got a whole collection with Mickey ears. You know, upside down, there's a pink and there's a yellow. I got some Goofies and Plutos and Minis and Mickeys. Um, and some Donalds. Here's my cool couple of my cool little Donalds. So I was able to get quite a few new ones that I didn't have. I, I mean, I'm going to say maybe I got 50. Um, this one I did get very well. It was a um, someone who had one of our pins was, I guess, valuable and I didn't know it. And they had some hidden that were more valuable. They were willing to trade us for those. And that one is a Star Wars. I was really excited about getting that because I did not have it. And I also really like Avengers. There's an Avengers one I was able to trade for. And here's a cute Spider-Man. Didn't have him. Um, we also got some letters. Because I have some letters. Uh, I like to finish the alphabet. I hate to uh, not have a collection complete. That's a W. There's an X. And this one is an N. I also just started getting some that I think are the pixelated kind. I don't really know, but they intrigue me. So I grabbed them when I could. And then we got some that start with Mater the Greater. Uh, we got two of those with Mater. I don't really know much about that, but you know, you gotta start somewhere. Of course, I got some other cool ones, like the Mouse Party and uh, this one. Really cool, different. I don't know where that one came from. Some other ones that I hadn't even seen before. You know, uh, some people love Cinderella and Snow White and all those. You know, and, and these are, I've always thought these were locks, but these are not locks, they're handbags. But, you know, they're ones I don't have, they're ones that are good for my collection. Oh, a cute little Donald Duck one right there. So I grab things that are different for my collection, things that I don't have, haven't previously bought. Here's a Halloweeny. It's gonna go in my Halloween set for sure. And, and, uh, you know, just so that I can have as many as I want. I always trade my doubles. When I run out of doubles, then I'm going to have to buy, like, a lot of them and uh, see which ones I want which ones to keep to sell. But there's a lot of really cute ones here. 
Now, which ones did I buy? Since I went there for Halloween, you know I was getting Halloween ones. And they were hard to find. Most places were sold out of the Halloween ones. The Emporium and Magic Kingdom was the only one who still had them. And uh, they didn't have that many. Now, this one I had here was very common. And him I found all over. He was a Star Wars and Halloween. He says, I want you to come to the dark side. I like that. And this one I found the very, this was the very first pin I bought. And when you open it up, look at that. <laughs> and I think that uh, it's because this movie just came out, the second one from Maleficent. So she was hard to get. And there wasn't many at many places, but I, I grabbed them when I could. <clears throat> the last day I found this one. They had a 25% off sale. Since I'm a pass holder, I get another 20. So it was like $7.50. I couldn't pass him up. My favorite uh, baseball team. You know, I'm going to grab a Yankees. And here's the ones I found at Magic Kingdom that were very rare. Not very rare, but very close to being sold out. They're all limited editions. That's a limited edition. They're about the Halloween Not So Scary Party. This is a limited edition, and it moves. I don't know if you can really see it because my hands are away. But it moves. It's really kind of cool. This one is a pass holder. It pays to be a pass holder because not only did I get 20% off on these when I bought them, you can get the pass holder pins. And you can't get those anywhere else. So so I was really happy. I come with quite a few pins, more than I expected. But, you know, I really should expect more because when you get pins, you really get addicted. So this I'm going to open up today. This is my Star Wars pack. You see on the back, you can see the ones you can get. And now we have already Stormtrooper and Darth Vader. So we're hoping to get two different ones. But we waited to open it in front of you. So let's open this together. I'll probably make a mess of the box. But let's open it together. These are uh, like $14.99 or something. But you get two. Let's see what we get. I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. I'm not going to look. Still dark. I can't see. Uh oh. What did we get? We got. Oh, C3PO. Don't have him. He's gonna go right to the collection. Let's see who else. Try not to look. Will I put it out? Hard. Who is this? Boba Fett. Two very good ones that I can't. I'm very excited to add to my collection. I don't have either one. But now I have on the box, uh, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have four of the eight. And uh, I, next time I go, I'll get another box. Hopefully, eventually, I'll get all the ones that I need. And the doubles, hey, I'll try to trade them, see what I can do. So, those are the pins that I bought. Now, what else did I get? Well, you know, we went into uh, Epcot and we found that because we were pass holders, they were giving away these that day. Look at those. Aren't those cute? I'm going to put one on my car, one on my refrigerator. We also, if you go four times in a certain amount of time, you get coasters. And so the next time we go, we will be able to get those coasters as long as we go in November. Now, another thing that we collected we did a lot of was pressed pennies. Had to buy the Disney books. I already have a book from Disney and it's already full, but I've got ones that I did not get before. This one is only three quarters full. Look at how cool they are. You know, the thing is, we wouldn't get these somewhere $1.25 and it was too much. We get the ones that are either 51 cents or eight for $5. If they're more than that, it doesn't seem like it's worth it. I mean, as much as you collect these, you can't have everything. And it's very expensive. Look at that one's all full. You know, we like the Star Wars, like we told you, Hollywood Studios. Uh, you know, maybe after we get all the cheap ones, We'll end up getting the one or two of the more expensive ones and eventually get the whole thing. I don't know. But there's a lot of them out there. When you go to there, you're going to find press pennies everywhere. It seems like there's 20 different places to get in, in each park. So, uh, you know, you have to decide which ones you want. Now, for the big reveal, I did get one big item in Disney. I usually don't spend this much. I didn't get t-shirts. I did not get anything I did not need. But I did get something special, and there's only 12 of these. Well, they're not limited editions. I don't know if they're limited, but there's 12 different kinds, and we got our first one. Ready? 
They are Thomas Kincaid so with certificate of authenticities. And they are Disney produced. I'll show you authenticities. This is for our wall. We're eventually gonna have all 12, we hope. Hope maybe with our luck we'll come out with another different 12 and we'll have to have 24. But it's really cool. And this was uh there were hundred dollars at the store. And of course, if you're a pass holder, you get a good discount. So, you know, we were able to get a good deal and we really like that. So that's what we bought at Disney this time. Besides bringing home the magical flu, we brought home a lot of other goodies. And there's a lot out there. If you're into t-shirts and Disney ears, they love those Mickey ears and the mini ears. They're all over the place. And there's so many and they are so adorable. So there's a lot of things you can't collect. I collect just the pins and the, the petties and now the, the Thomas Kincaid prints. But you know, uh, you have a lot of fun at Disney. So this is Rockin' Robin. Thank you for watching. Uh, keep subscribing our channel below onto the red thing and press the button. We really appreciate that. If you want to see more Disney stuff, please also click on our stuff because we have everything Disney you can imagine. And we're going to have more coming all the time. And uh, we really want to make you happy. Please leave a comment. Let us know what it is you want. Look for the video because we're giving away a $200 Visa card. And uh, if you look and watch the video, it will tell you what you have to do in order to be eligible to uh, get that prize. We like to give away stuff. We always want to give away stuff. I don't know if I can give away pins, but maybe one of these days we'll give us away something Disney. So keep watching. Once again, this is Rockin' Robin. Have a Disney day.